Alright, so in this problem, I have 8 to the power of x is equal to 80. So to solve this, I'm going to first start by taking the log on both sides. So now I have log of 8 to the power of x is equal to log 80. Now if I have something in the form log a to the power of b, I can move this exponent b to the front. So this is going to equal b times log a. So in this case, I have log a to the power of x. So I can move x here to the front. So now I have x times log 80, it, or sorry, x times log 8 is equal to log 80. So now we want to isolate x here. So I'm going to go ahead and divide both sides by log 8. So I can move log 8 to the right hand side. So now on my left hand side, these two are going to cancel out. And now I have x is equal to log 80 over log 8. So now log 80 here, well, 80 is the same thing as 10 times 8. So I'm going to rewrite 80 as, or sorry, log of 80 as log of 10 times 8. And if I have something in the form log of a times b, this is equal to log a plus log b. So in this case, log 10 times 8, that's going to equal log 10 plus log 8. And now I have this over log 8. So now to solve this, I'm going to rewrite this as log 10 over log 8 plus log 8 over log 8. Now, anything divided by itself is 1, so log 8, log 8, those two cancel out. So now I have log 10 over log 8 plus 1. And log 10 is also 1, so I have x is equal to 1 over log 8 plus 1. So log 8, that's the same thing as 2 times log 3. Or sorry. 3 times log 2, which is equal to 2.1074. Alright, so in this problem, I have 3 to the power of x is equal to 7 to the power of x plus 2. So to solve this, first off, if I have something in the form a to the power of m plus n, this is equal to a to the power of m times a to the power of n. So in this case, 7 to the power of x plus 2, I can rewrite as 7 to the power of x times 7 to the power of 2. Now, I'm going to go ahead and divide both sides by 7 to the power of x. So then these two cancel out, and now I'm left with 3 to the power of x over 7 to the power of x is equal to 7 squared. Now, if I have something in the form a to the power of m over a to the power of n, this is equal to, sorry, a to the power of m over b to the power of m, this is equal to a over b to the power of m. So 3 to the power of x over 7 to the power of x, that's going to equal 3 over 7 to the power of x, which is equal to 7 squared. And now I'm going to take the log on both sides. So I have log 3 over 7 to the power of x is equal to log 7 squared. And if I have something in the form log a to the power of b, I can move this exponent b to the front. So this is going to equal b times log a. So log of 3 over 7 to the power of x, I can move x to the front. And log 7 squared, I can move 2 to the front. So now I have x times log 
3 over 7 is equal to 2 times log 7. And now if I divide both sides by log of 3 over 7, these two cancel out. And now I have x is equal to 2 log 7 over log 3 over 7. Now, if I have something in the form log a over b, this is equal to log a minus log b. So log 3 over 7, that's going to equal log 3 minus log 7. So this is my answer. All right, so in this problem, I have 100 to the power of x is equal to 200. So to solve this, I'm going to first take the log on both sides. So now I have log of 100 to the power of x is equal to log 200. Now, if I have something in the form log a to the power of b, I can move this exponent of b to the front. So this is equal to b times log a. So in this case, I have log 100 to the power of x, and then I can move x to the front. So now I have x times log 100 is equal to log 200. Now, I'm going to divide both sides by log 100. So then these two cancel out, and now I have x is equal to log 200 over log 100. Now log 200, this is the same thing as log of 100 times 2. And I have this over log 100. So now if I have something in the form log of a times b, this is equal to log a plus log b. So log 100 times 2, that's going to equal log 100 plus log 2. And now I have this over log 100. So now I have log 100 over log 100 plus log 2 over log 100. Now log 100 is simply equal to 2. So I have 2 over 2 plus log 2 over log 100. Which is equal to 1 plus log 2 over 2. 